Hello everybody, back here again for our vlog day, and today is Tuesday the 12th, and today was a pretty decent day I guess overall. Um, the weather held out pretty good for me that. I went down to the shed, um, warehouse, whatever you want to call it, and picked up some stuff. I needed to get repriced in that and get some stuff ready to take up to the flea market um, booth tomorrow, and also got a handful of things stuck on eBay in that. Just a bunch of, I don't know, cheap stuff starting out at 99 cents. See if I can get any interest in it, get anybody bidding on some stuff. I put buy it now, so it's like 20 bucks on all of it. Can't imagine anybody's going to buy it now for that price, but hey, it kind of gives them an idea. And if somebody doesn't want to mess with the whole waiting around for something to end, they're more than welcome to go ahead and bid 20 bucks on it. So anyway, I think I got like a dozen things on eBay. I've got probably 45 things um, repriced, ready to go up to the flea market booth that way I can kind of add in some of the empty spots and whatever and whatnot I'm gonna grab some of the discount coupons and start marking a few things down in that the worst problem I have is the fact it's like four hours round trip up there and back and I don't know what I've sold already because they don't have any like automated update and that kind of junk so until I get there I don't know how many openings I have in that so I hate taking up a whole bunch of stuff and then having to bring it back but I hate not having enough stuff to go refill what I've sold already. So it's kind of one of those things. It's kind of a catch-22, but what can you do? So anyway, the only thing I guess I could possibly do is just take up a ton of stuff and just, you know, kind of set it out in levels of things that I want to take per box in. And then if I don't need it, bring it back home. And if I do need it, go ahead and put it out. So one of the things I want to do, I just haven't got around to it yet, is I want to start rotating some of the stuff that's there. Um, put a mark on it since it's been there for like a month, whatever, put it in the box, bring it home, and then take it back up in a month or two and try it out. That way I don't have the same stuff sitting there constantly. I've got enough uh, medium low-end stuff that I can rotate that stuff out of there quite often, and I have not done that yet. Um, i gotten really lazy. The whole thought of driving up that far just absolutely just sucks, you know. And then, I don't know, I just... I don't know, I kind of lost a little bit of interest in it, but we'll see what happens. Tomorrow, hopefully I'll get up there, I'll have a good time, um, reorganize stuff. I'm hoping I'll see a bunch of stuff is sold, and uh, I've got some decent cash rolling in off it, and who knows what. So, doubt that's going to be the case, but you never know until you get there and look around. So, hoping I can find a few items that I have lots of that people want to buy from there, and I can start moving that stuff through and keep it restocked and keep it moving. So, haven't found that item yet, but I'm hoping to. So... Also, I um, skipped the gym today. I went ahead and just, I don't know, so I didn't really feel like going to the gym today. Uh, we had some crazy weird, like, freak snowstorm kind of come through. It didn't mount nothing, but it was snowing like a demon there for a little bit. It was kind of strange, so just, I didn't have any running due today. It was on my off training day for running. And I probably should went there and hit the gym anyway for some other stuff and just, I don't know, kind of put it off. Decided to do the whole uh, flea market email thing instead. I thought that was more important today than doing that, so... Also tomorrow, my hope is to get up there in the morning, get all my stuff done, and then get to an auction. They have an auction up there every Wednesday night. I want to get to it, see if I can't find a few items to make a couple of dollars on. So that's all I know for now. I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Have yourself a safe and wonderful day, and thanks for watching.